Welcome back to Let's Play DDA Permadeath. And here we are, part two of Delirious. I uh, did try and craft a plus five search item again since the last quest and failed. And tried crafting a pure good item, but uh, didn't have enough crafting levels in Divine. So I'm not really any better off than I was, except that I have now have the um, Holy Turkey League from that guy in the graveyard, which I can use as an off-hander against the ghostly skeletons. And it's working pretty well. That's my first impression, anyway. Yep, having the offhander definitely helps. You notice a rusty lever behind the grate to the side of the hallway. to uh, switch back and forth between bludgeoning and, uh, and my good weapon set in here. I forgot the need a hireling. All right, be back for try two in a few minutes. All right, I believe third time lucky. This time I both remember the hireling and remember to start recording. All right. He can stay back there until I need him. Alright, it looked pretty good for this quest now. I'm doing good damage against the ghostly skeletons, and I've seen anything causing me trouble in the previous quest.
Yeah, so the main path should be pretty safe apart from the uh, trap. Which hopefully my DCs are high enough to hit. Nice, I killed them in the right order. I couldn't remember if you had to kill the ghostlies all first or all last, but I thought it was all first. Apparently I was right. Underwater action. Okay, just an underwater action um, clicky. Okay, so I need to reverse a. Then I'm good. Alright, he's perfectly positioned. Okay, let's see what happens. Point to me. Mm. 
This bit gets unpleasant. Although my DR is pretty good, so perhaps, perhaps it's not too unpleasant. Wasn't too bad. You can easily go for a hundred, hundred and fifty hit points on that fight. Having the uh, urban guard and my uh, invulnerability uh, chainmail certainly helps a lot there. An unusual fight, and not much happens during it, but it can easily just sap your health away. Alright, nice. Done with my hiling there, having soaked him in water for about two minutes. I was slightly worried he might drown in the water. I haven't seen him do that, but then I've never parked one in the middle of a lake before. Gilgren will say you can't resurrect hirelings, so it would be pretty inconvenient if he died. Those arcanes don't have many hit points. At least something in here doesn't. Alright, you go that way if you like.
Okay, onwards. The archers are doing so little damage, they're basically just a nuisance, except in that one big fight I've already been through. Nice that they usually don't save against Trip either. Copper pieces, level 7 on Elite. Nice chunk of XP for this one. Okay, super deadly trap. Okay, not going in that one then. That's not a good sign for the lighter trap. I guess they're the same DC as well. Yeah, I do really need a better search item.
Okay. Right, so that was painless. The next fight might not be quite so painless. Yeah, that's a lot of guys. the casters will stand behind that pillar for me. I thought there was more than one. Copper pieces. Your idea. All right. He did nearly land a uh, whole person on me. Although I've still got the effects of the heroism potion on, so my saves are reasonable right now. The vault bomb was going to pop out there. Another one of the game's memorable moments. very distinctive that moment, coming up the ramp there and uh, the skeletons slowly emerging from the ground.
Uh, here's the big trap. Having failed on the previous one, I'm not optimistic about this one. Nope. Guy down the trap. It's so dark in here, I can hardly see the spikes. Back out of sight of the archers. No, not the other side. Okay. Stay here, work that lever. Get him out of the way before he gets killed in the, in the next ambush. Actually, I thought there was going to be an ambush there. I guess not. Sweet, that's the way to do it. Trip one, son of the other. Uh, missed the thunder that time.
this is a dangerous spot. Sometimes people end up pulling both arcanes at the same time. Wait until my trip comes back and then charge the other arcane. Also very easy, um, tends to be most dangerous in groups this spot. Um, very often one or two players fall off doing the balancing things of the uh, skeleton archers that are jumping around. And if you uh, don't realise you've lost a party member, um, you can get in trouble here. Alright, we need to try and... This is going pretty well though, and it's certainly a big uh, wall of XP. In spite of not being able to do the traps. It has to be said, having a trapping ability on this guy hasn't been super useful so far. Nor has the UMD, making me rethink my uh, rogue levels. Well, rogue level. Damn, he's in a little bit spot there. I don't remember this being trappy. And that was Conquest. Nice. Ship bus run out in one minute. That being the case, let's try and end it fast.
Uh, yeah, I still have had the Lara selected. Got him before my XP bonus uh, chipped up went away. My search is good enough for the secret doors, fortunately. a big chunk of XP as well. Must be very near 20,000. Alright, thanks for watching.